welcome back to my channel and welcome back to the Apple Learning Tree. If you're new here, my name's Jen and I've got two children. I've got a five-year-old boy and a two-year-old girl. And today I thought I'd show you what is in my Jujube diaper bag. I first started watching YouTube. This is what I used to watch and I love watching what's in people's bags videos. And because my little girl has started potty trading, I thought this would be the last chance to show you what's in my diaper bag. So this is the Jujube Zealous. I'll link below what color it is. I became a big GGB fan about six years ago when I was pregnant with my first child and I've loved them ever since. They're really, really good fabric. You can put them in the washing machine to wash. So they're great bags to travel with, to take to like parks and zoos and things because you can just throw it in the wash if it gets dirty. I've always used backpacks. I just find it great and uh, to be hands-free and um, just holds a lot of stuff. Now, I do overpack. I like having everything I need with me. So in the front here, you've got one little zipper pocket and another main pocket, which is called the mummy one. So in this pocket, I just usually keep, because it's not that deep, I usually keep like hand sanitizer, tissues, more tissues and some kind of like wipes and a lip balm as well. So those are the things I keep in the front pocket. So in this mummy pocket, it comes it all the way down and then it opens up quite wide. And here I've got some more just Milton wipes, which are antibacterial wipes. I've got my little Jujube wallet. And then here I've also got a little Jujube car holder. I will link all the names of the prints because I always forget them, so I'll put them on the screen. And then inside you've got a little key leash. You've got a little slip pocket here and I've just got Kind of more uh, store cards kept in here. This is another GGB card holder. And then I've got a few more store cards there and a few hair ties for my little girl. And then you've got another pocket here, which I've got some children's hand sanitizer. It's kind of like the foam, so it's a bit more gentle on their hands. And I've got another GGB wallet here. And then here I've just got more store cards and then I've got a little Clinique lip balm in there and you do have another little zipper pocket here which comes, goes down I don't really tend to keep anything in there but it's quite nice if you want to keep anything secure and private so that is the money pocket it goes really far down but I haven't got anything in there so you've got some really good water bottle pockets and they are very deep this is a clean canteen it's quite thick and then even though if your bag is full, it fits really nicely in there. In the main pocket, you've got two zips. Oh. It can open up quite wide. Like that. Because my daughter is potty training now, we've got a little toilet seat here. And then I've just got some wipes for when we're out and about. So in this GGP pouch, this comes in a set of three. This is the medium size one. And in this, I just have some spare clothes for my daughter. The little cute little packing cubes. They've got mesh on the sides. So that is the medium set one. And then also in Jujube Rainbow Dreams, I've got this quick. And in this, I have um, just a spare diaper, changing mat, wipes, um, some more underwear. And then usually I'll stick our little toilet seat in here as well. And then just carry this to the toilet if we need to. So that is Rainbow Dreams. So these are the Quicks. I have a bunch of these in different colors. I love the Quicks. They are perfect for anything really. We put, I put toys in there when we're traveling. I put things for the restaurants like bibs and utensils. They're great because they're quite the waterproof. So it's great to take for the pool and having your pool bags and beach. In the back here, you've got a little elastic and you've got these two elastic there, which you can put some wipes up there. So you can put wipes up there if you want, or it's good for holding a blanket as well. The elastic bit back here, I've got things for entertainment for the two kids. And because I usually kind of carry this out on the weekends, I usually tend to go to restaurants sometimes. So I've just got a little play mat here. This is for my little girl. 
this is just off Etsy. It's just like a little princess playmat. So in the back here, I've got a little Minecraft book for my five-year-old, as well as a 555 sticker book for him. Another Minecraft activity book for him. I've got I've got a little magazine for my little girl and a coloring book. And I've just got a little LCD drawing pad for them. Back here, you've got these elastic pockets here. And in one, I've got another GGB. This is the small set piece. So it comes in a three set. This is Sushi Cars. This one's my one of my favorite prints. And in here, I've got some cars for my little girl and some Hot Wheels cars for my little boy. And then the other one in this little small set piece, this little case, I just have kind of medical things for myself. So I've got some Nurofen, paracetamol, plasters. The bottom, it's kind of like, it's quite deep down there. I have a little snack bag that's from Itty Ritty and I just carry some dry snacks, granola bars and things. And then I have a wet bag here just in case there are any accidents. In the bag, there are two more elastic pockets. In the pocket, I just have two McDonald's toys for the kids and some reusable straws. So you can fit quite a lot in these pockets. And then on the other side, I've just got some crayons and some soda cream cream oh, and, and another little first aid kit which is more for the children so i've got some paracetamol i've got some antiseptic cream some kids plasters and a pack of like cow pole in case anything if we're away for a long time and this is a GGB, but it was a custom piece, which I got off Etsy, I think. Um, or I might have got the second hand, I can't remember. That is it. That is everything I carry in my diaper bag. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that video. Please consider subscribing to my channel and giving this video a big like. And I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.